Hey, 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 it is your favorite remote work enthusiast, Delilah. So in this video, I want to show the two different types of headsets that you may need when doing an online position. And this could be whether you're working in a call center or in customer service or even teaching online. And there's only two types of headsets. Now there's a million different brands out there and they all work the same, but you just wanna make sure that you get the right equipment. Okay, so first up is a USB headset and you can see a USB headset has a USB ending that can plug into the USB port on your computer and this particular headset um, I purchased from Walmart. Now I am also speaking on a USB headset and this one I believe came from Amazon. They are both Logitechs and they're the same brand. However, they're a little bit different. So the ending is the same, but as far as like the actual headset goes, this one has like a plastic a, a mouthpiece and the plastic mouthpiece, it can go up and down. Um, but this one that I'm speaking on, it's like a, a bendy mouthpiece. So like I can make it straight if I want, or I can curve it to my mouth or something. And this one that I'm speaking on is also a little bit um, less bulky than this one. Now this is an excellent headset. I still use this occasionally if I'm um, for example, maybe like washing the ear pads on this headset and both of these headsets and pretty much every headset that you purchase will come with detachable ear pads. So you can detach the ear pad and you can um, wash it by hand. You're probably supposed to do that, but I just put mine in the laundry with my other clothes and um, over time it does kind of like wear out the little plastic part on there like with the one i'm wearing i guess i'll take it off so you can kind of see like that that eventually will happen if you put it in the washing machine but <laughs> i didn't really care so i i just go ahead and put it in there like it still works fine it's just not as you know nice and pristine um if i had just like washed it by hand but it doesn't feel any different on my ear. It works just fine. So yeah, this one is a little bit more bulkier than the one I'm wearing, but in general, uh, they, they're they pretty much the same besides like the couple of things that I mentioned. And putting the ear pad back on is really simple. So you just uh, take the mesh part, like it comes with a little, like the, the ear pad has like a little mesh part behind it. And you would just put that back on there so I can do that now so we can see what that looks like it's not too tricky um, but I do recommend washing your headset because you can uh, get ear infections that way anything that goes on your ear and if you don't wash it you can get ear infections and things of that nature so you just want to make sure that you are keeping your headset clean and there we go all right, I got it back on there for the most part. It's not it's not that hard to get back on there, but that's it. And now it's back on there and you can do the same thing with the other one. So that's a USB headset. Again, the ending will have a USB port and this just plugs into your computer. Okay, the next type of headset is the kind that can plug into your landline telephone. And you will see this referred to in that way where um, maybe the job post or the company that you're working for mentions that you'll need a headset that can plug into your landline, or they might use an acronym POTS, which stands for plain old telephone uh, service or system. And basically that's referring to a landline that would come from your wall or um, your modem. So I have, I think it's like AT&T or someone, <laughs> and my phone line, um, it's this typical phone line. I don't think I can show it on here, but it it's like the kind that would come from your wall, but instead of it coming from my wall, it comes from the modem. And it's um, your traditional phone service, if you will. So that's uh, the kind of headset that you would use for uh, that. And this would be that headset. And the ending 
if you see it, the ending is pretty tiny. And this is a different ending than the uh, headphone ending, which this particular headset actually has an adapter to where it can kind of go from device to device. So the type of head phone ending that I'm referring to that would not work would be this one. Now this is something that you would plug into like um, your phone. For example, like let's say I wanted to listen to some music on my phone. I would plug this one into the phone and it fits and you can kind of see like my phone just lit up because now this uh, plugs in there, but this would not work with the phone so you see this is where you would plug it in i've got my phone here and this is too big it won't fit in there um you would need to use uh, the proper size so let me hook it back up you need to use this one and i'll plug it into the phone just so you can kind of see the difference but this one actually plugs into the phone so now i can plug it in and now i'm ready to start talking on my phone this would not fit into like a headphone jack you see like it just goes right in like it's too small okay so those are the two different types of headsets and again there's either the usb uh, port headset or the type that plugs into the base of your landline telephone and you would just want to make sure that the job lead or if you're already working in the position um your manager could clarify which type you would need in order for you to start working from home. And you can get these from anywhere. I believe I purchased uh, the this headset from Walmart. And then the one that I'm speaking on now was from Amazon. And then the um, other headset that plugs into my base, it's somewhere, too many headsets. I got that from Walmart as well. And you would just wanna make sure that you clarify you know, what kind of ending it has, because the ones that plug into the telephone, they are a little bit challenging to find. I went to a few different Walmarts when I got that one. So you could just uh, purchase it off of Amazon and I'll put the links in the description below in case you want to um, get the headsets that I have. So hopefully this was helpful and I will talk to you all soon. Ready to start working from home but not sure how to get started? Be sure to check out my course, How to Find a Remote Job. In the course, I give in-depth training on how to locate and secure legitimate work from home positions, as well as in-depth resume, interviewing, and onboarding training. I also include the exact resume template that I use to get hired for my remote opportunity. Be sure to check it out.